I'm going to show you how to upload grades to Canvas. The first step is to export your current gradebook. Now I'm going to name this one Fake Grades Export for Video because we're doing some fake grades. You can open that file and you will see that your first column has the student names in it, then you have some ID numbers, then you have these user IDs which end with at psu.edu and here's section. Here are all of the columns for which you currently have scores. And you can see this is from a previous semester. So what you can do is delete all of these. And now you have an assignment that you want graded. So fake assignment. And then just go and you enter some scores. Now, I have already made another Excel file that I want to show you. So this one is the same thing, but now I have two assignments. I have clicker session and fake grade. Notice that not all students have done both of the assignments. Some haven't done any, some have done both. But now that you have entered your grades on this roster, you're ready to upload them. So go back to Canvas and tell it to import grades. Then you have to pick a CSV file. This can't be an Excel file. It has to be comma separated values. Now, once you select your file, upload data. And now it's reading these two assignments. So uh, they're not in my gradebook before now. When Canvas doesn't recognize your column header, it will ask what you want to do with it. So it's either a new assignment or bogus ignore it, or it could be something you meant like clicker session I could scroll down, oh, that's what I meant, clicker f week 15. So it reads this points possible out of the second row of your Excel file. So see, this is worth one point, this is worth 88 points. So here we have 1.88 points. So you can create a new assignment, and I'll show you that in a second, but uh, I'm going to take this fake grade and show you uh, something that is optional to do before you upload the grades. You could go to assignments and you could add an assignment and you could call it fake grade and then description and then I'm just going to put this into the clicker category as well and then you can save and publish it. Now when you go back to your gradebook, if you import the same file, you will see that now it doesn't recognize clicker session so you can make a new assignment. You could assign it to clicker week 12 or whatever but it's not so say it's a new assignment and when you continue, here's clicker session, fake grade, and you can do a spot check on a student name. Notice that there was no previous score, and we're uploading a new score. It will highlight in red if there's a change in the scores. So if you already had data and you're re-uploading data, it will show you that there's a change, and you can double check. So then you can just hit save changes, and then you can find them in your gradebook. Now back in the gradebook you can see this clicker session. You can see this clicker session and if I edit I find that it was grouped under semester score. I don't want that. I want it under clickers. I can go back and change that. Hit save. Alright so now you have uploaded items to the Canvas gradebook. Congratulations.